It's it's actually hard to believe. Um, I think back to 2003 when we all met out. At that time, we were probably a company of 15 people. We met at the Oregon Golf Club. And created our mission statement, our core values, and, and now we're sitting here eight and a half years later uh, talking about 2013, 14, and 15 and doing over $300 million worth of work. Uh, if you would have told me that then, I would have been alarmed. <laughs> When I look at what our, what's made us where we are today, and there's a lot of curiosity around the industry about what are those guys doing um, to get to where they are right now. And I think we're just uh, operating with, with young, passionate people who really have a tremendous work ethic and like what they're doing. When you challenge people with some of those opportunities, uh, things that they can aspire to, I think you get the best out of folks, and that's what hopefully we've been able to do. Uh, relationships within our company, I think we've built stronger bonds together. Uh, external relationships with our clients have been fantastic. Uh, I think if you look at the work that we've got in 2011 specifically, the amount of repeat work we got is due to the relationships that we've built. You know, the company name is, is significant, and the reason the, the reason our name is Fortis, uh, being strength, they're derived from strength, but to me it comes down to the people, that's what makes the engine go. It's back to our core values, I mean, you're right, people are everything in this business, it's a relationship business, core value number one, people in our company take pride in what they do. Pride and winning, having that go-getter attitude. They're very energetic and pioneering, they like to do different things, and last but not least, they love to win. And that's what Forrest likes to do, win. That's what clients want, excited about what they do and, and are energetic about what they do. And uh, all of us retain that. Again, quite frankly, it's the people. You just can't uh, compare us to other contractors uh, from a standpoint of the quality and the integrity of our people and the determination and the will to win. It's uh, far beyond most of the, or any of the other contractors I've seen. Our, our biggest difference is, is, is our culture. And, you know, we, we talk about this a lot. Uh, uh, we spend quite a bit of time talking about our culture and, and, and what does that culture really mean? Uh, and, and I honestly believe that that is the difference. I honestly believe that's why we are winning the jobs that we're winning, and I believe that's why we're succeeding on the jobs after we're able to win them. I think 2012 holds uh, another year of very robust growth when the rest of the economy is seeing uh, sort of a very stagnant market still. And that has to do with a combination of things. Number one, it's the market sectors we're involved in. It's uh, got to do with, again, the talent and quality of the employees at Fortis. And it has to do with everyone's determination and dedication. Somewhere up above the stars. I really believe that, that our future is the people that we have here and the people that we're going to continue to have, you know, uh, working with us. Customers don't say, oh, can I have Fortis back? They're looking, can I have uh, Chip back, Tim back, um, Natasha back, whoever it may be. And that's really where you want to be because each job that we do is its own business center in the way we kind of look at the work. So when we're doing 110 jobs a year and we're taking all the employees in the company, everyone's running their own business center, which accumulates to what makes up the volume or the year for Fortis.
You know, I, I don't think anyone wants to put a number on it. I think it gets back to the people, and if we have people that want to grow this company and take it to a level that uh, you know is sustainable, and um, we can continue to do A plus work, um, we're going to continue to grow and be successful. Looking ahead into next year, I think you know the sky's the limit. We continue to not be able to answer the question, "How big do you want to be?" because. Uh, it isn't going to be driven by what David, Rennie, or I want this to be. It's going to be driven by what the employees and everybody who works here wants to do together as a team. Um, and really, I think the opportunities are endless. I am so excited about our future because we have got all-stars at every position, and it feels great to be in an organization like that. Hey, does anybody know where David is this week?